Hey everyone, this is Derek from CHRW, and today I'm going to teach you how to create links and embed media within your blog entry. First off, highlight the text you want to create a link to, then on the top menu of the body section, click on the link button. A pop-up window will appear and you can enter in the web address that you want to create a link to within the URL section. You can also change the link type from a URL to an email and create a link to an email address. After creating link, you may also want to embed different kinds of media onto your blog entry. But first, you'll need to get a widget code. Within YouTube, you can get your widget code by clicking on Share and Embed within the submenu. You can change your video size prior to copying the widget code. But keep in mind, the maximum video size you can post up on the CHRW blog is 640 by 360. Within SoundCloud, you can get your widget code by clicking on the Share button that is located on the bottom of every playlist and song. Double-click the text in the widget code section and copy the text. In Vimeo, if you hover your mouse over the video, you can click on the Share button located on the right-hand side of the video. In the pop-up window, select all the text in the Embed section and copy the text. For the purposes of my blog entry, I will be embedding a video from YouTube from the artist I am writing about. I will now go to my YouTube video, click Share, Embed, and copy the embed code. I will now go back to my blog entry and click on Source located on the top menu of the body section. I will then paste my widget code on the bottom of the page and click Source again. You will now see an empty box with the words iframe on it located on your blog entry. Now click Save to save your blog entry. You will be brought back to your account page. Now underneath the unpublished post section, click edit on the blog entry you are working on. Then on the top right hand side of the page, click view to see how your blog entry will look like on the CHUW website. It is important to double check your blog entry before publishing it for errors such as spelling, grammar, and broken links. Once you have checked to see that all your links work, you will now be ready to publish your blog entry.